Hey there, good buddy. This is Tim the Trucker. I'm sitting along the edge of US 127 up in Michigan looking at an accident through my rearview mirror on July 20th, 2015. This accident was caused by a state police officer. And this video shows the events that led up to this accident. Some more, and I work for the Michigan State Police. The reason that I stopped your vehicle today was for your speed. Back on 96, when you were going west, before you got to the Oakman's rest area, I picked up twice on laser the first time at 65, the second time at 66. You're gonna need your driver's license. and proof of insurance for the truck. Yeah, you can get it for me if you would. You can go ahead and take care of your medical card. This one shows it expired June 15th, so you should have a newer version than this. That's your insurance. You got a whole bunch of insurance. Stuff. Those are old too? So this is good. Hey, 
Maybe. Nope. Right there. Just let's take a look at that. Yeah, that says the same thing. So you should have a newer one of these. This one shows that it expired June 15th. Maybe. Yep. Alright, I'll trade you. You can have those. Do we have a load on? Yeah. Okay, can I? sheet and a blank record of duty status which is a paper logbook. Oh yeah. We don't have to fill them up. No, but you have to have them. Oh, because yeah. if something happens to this, okay. how else would you keep your log? Yeah, yeah, I got logbooks in here. Okay, I I would need to see it.
look at your logbook. turns that'll probably pop right off there if you needed to. Alright, let's take a look at your summary. Home. Messaging. You have 4 hours and 54 minutes of remaining drive time. Okay, and then we'll go to today's log. In graph. Okay. with you. How's your driving record? Many of the states acknowledge that one of the major causes of accidents on the highways today are police officers that are pulling people over and writing citations when it's not necessary. With these new laws today that requires vehicles to move to the left or slow down, many of the amateur motorists try to do both. And slowing down and moving left is creating congestion and eliminating the marge the safety margins that vehicles have between each other and you end up with rear end collisions or as in this situation we have a camper that in order to avoid someone else had to go into the ditch and so many of the states encourage police officers not to pull people over 
unless it's absolutely necessary and in this situation today it was not necessary and so this police officer that decided he had to pull me over and write do, do this inspection ended up causing this accident now fortunately for me he doesn't want anything on the record that ties him to the accident so he's not going to be able to write me a citation he's going to only encourage me to leave so that there's no court documents that proves that he was here and his actions today is what ultimately led to this car being in the ditch. This is going to be your copy of the Federal Safety Compliance Checklist form. It lets the company that you work for know where you were stopped, that you were driving, where you're coming from and going to. It's got the violation of the posted speed and then the half hour violation on the 17th. The company will sign date and title of who signed it. You'll sign on the bottom as I have, indicating that I gave you that copy to turn into them. They're going to mail it or fax it back to the state of Michigan within 15 days. Okay, there's no fines or costs or anything like that associated with the inspection. It was just a paperwork check. Alright, do you have any questions for me? No. Okay. 
You're all set. When you're ready, put your signal on and I'll try to help you back out, okay? Well, you can take care of him. I'll be okay. Okay. Well, I put you here, so it's kind of my responsibility to make sure that you get back out. Well, I, only I can flip around up here and get right back. I only got a couple miles to go. All right, thanks.